wanna lick my cheesy Cheeto finger? Happy Monday! Something just flew in my eye, of course. Um, we are on our way to, I have to stop at my post office real quick, and then we're gonna go to Sephora, which is in JCPenney, because I need to return this. I need to return this Saint-Tropez tan. I can't stand it. I tried so hard <coughs> to be able to tolerate it. <coughs> Excuse me, but I can't tolerate it. The smell is just too much. I can't. I just can't. It's, I smell like a foot. I just can't. So, yeah. It gave good color for the most part. I mean, I don't, I, I did get a little yellow. <laughs> in the rough patches, but I don't know. I'm just, I don't want to have to deal with it. That's part of the reason why I never used self tanner to begin with was because even if I liked it, I would have to upkeep. You have to upkeep. It's just, I'm just going to embrace my paste. <laughs> embrace my paste. Embrace my pastiness. And call it good so but I need to get to the post office first so I don't forget and then we'll go so it's a beautiful day it's gonna be sunny and hot all week long You guys, I, I only spent $30 of my own money. I took back my Sephora, and since it's at JCPenney, and I, and well, okay, I took my back some, blah, blah, blah. I took back my Sephora. And because I had purchased my Sephora stuff with Sephora gift cards, they were only able to give me back a gift card, which is fine. 
they they weren't they couldn't put it back on a credit card. That's fine. So they gave me just a JCPenney card to use throughout JCPenney or Sephora. And so, of course, I got sidetracked by the clothes. And I bought everything that I showed you. And I also bought a black cute skirt that was on sale for $12. Everything was $12.99, $12.99. I think one thing was $17.99, $12.99. So, and so it came to like 70 some odd dollars, but then I had my 40% off coupon. Wait, <laughs> I had my $42 gift in-store gift card to use. And so it came to like 40, 40 something dollars. And then she hit another button and it took it down to $30 and change. I was like, okay. So I spent 30 bucks and got all that stuff. I'm very pleased. I was not expecting to do that at all, but I did. And I think they were having sales on Nike and stuff like that. At least they were in the girls department. I don't know if they are for the guys. So I'm gonna tell Daryl that we're gonna check online and see if there's a Nike sale going on at JCPenney for the guys. Cause Daryl wants some new clothes cause he wants some bigger ones, but he wants, you know, like some Nike t-shirts or some shorts or something. JCPenney's having a good sale. I will have to tell him. So anyway, I'm dying. Yes, my blood sugar's down. I had a yogurt this morning and then two Chips Ahoy cookies before I got um, ready, before I did my hair. So like that was one and that's all I've had. And now I'm about ready to pass out. I have stuff in my, in my purse. Like I have a granola bar and I have a little pack of cookies, but where is Binger? Okay, but I don't want all that. Cause dinner's gonna be soon and I don't wanna spoil my dinner. So, it is 4.30. I'm gonna put dinner in at 5.30. We'll eat at 6.30. And that'll be that. I'm so thrilled with my new stuff. And everything I tried on first, I had in medium. But then I thought it looked a little big, so I went and tried it all back on in a small, and I'm in a small. But you know, JCPenney has big smalls. So, I have no clue where I'm going. They, for all of you who live in Utah, on the west side, there's a thing called Bangor Highway. And it's just a little fast track, little highway. But they're adding on to it and making it wider and adding ramps and off ramps and on ramps. And that never, it's freaking me out because the roads are all skewwampus right now. And when I was going to JCPenney, I totally drove right by it because they made a new off ramp. Instead of going left and turning left, you have to get off at the right. And I just drove on by. I'm like, what the hell? Where am I? Because I was just here like two days ago. And it wasn't like that. So, so I had to drive like two extra miles down to the next light to turn around and come all the way back. And now I'm thinking, okay, where do I get off on now? Now I'm gonna have to get off to the left. But here comes a freaking idiot speeder that was gonna thump me up the butt and someone will let him get in front of me. Cause he's a loser. Okay, I don't even know if anything I just said made sense because I was trying to concentrate and I'm delirious from starvation, so. Anyway, okay. I will see you when we get back. Just walked in the door. It is so hot outside, you don't even know. So I'm gonna come in the bathroom where I have my hooks and I'll show you the clothes I got. Whoops. Everything.
using is sea green and blue and peach, but that's the colors of the year, I guess, because that's what everything was. Okay, so first of all, I got this really cute skirt. It's really stretchy and boingy, and it was $12.99. It's amazing. It is so cute. Let's see. trying to think here. So the first thing I have is this top and it's got the ruffle detail and then it actually, here's the armpit hole right here. But I was so bummed because I didn't have it in medium so I thought well I'll just try it in a small and that's when I realized their smalls are big, so this is plenty large. I love it. I don't know if it'll shrink. It's 85% polyester, 15% rayon. Is it gonna shrink, you guys? Let me know. Ugh. So anyway, here's that. I just hate the possibility of shrinkage, whether it be in my clothes or in my man. Now I got this blouse and I got another one just like it in blue. Tell me that's not a hole. Okay, good, that's not a hole. And this is also polyester rayon. This said 65% polyester, 35% rayon. But it's just super cute. It's a lot more green in real life. Right now it kind of looks almost baby blue, but it's really green. And here's a blue one just like it and I just like how they drape down they're not tight or anything and they're nice and loose and airy for this weather we're having and these were both $12.99 and this was $12.99 so I think this one was the only one I think this one was $17.99 but I love it and this is a hundred percent cotton and I love the flowers. So that's what I got. I know I'm bad. I need to go to JCPenney more often. They have the cutest clothes. And I just haven't gone because there's all that construction there. But it's about getting finished up. So they just have really cute stuff. And then their Liz Claiborne stuff is extra cute, all their new stuff, but it wasn't on sale, so I didn't get anything like that. But I am just thrilled. I'm just thrilled. And I'm cleaning out my closet because the Big Brother's Big Sister's truck is coming tomorrow. So I have to get all those things together. And then I told Daryl he needs to clean out his closet too because he's got more t-shirts and stuff that he's not wearing that he's got to get rid of. Our closets are full and especially his. He's got clothes upstairs in bins because they won't fit down in here. Oh, he's like a girl. Anyway, so that's that. Let's see, it's five o'clock and half hour. I'm gonna put the chicken cordon bleu in the oven and we're having green beans from the can and that's what's for dinner tonight. And for the makeup of the day, I haven't done this in a while. I have my, let's see, I wore this one on the lid, I wore these two in the crease, this one and this one, and then I wore this one on the outer corner, and then I put this one on really super close to my upper lash line. So that's what I wore today. Even though I'm wearing gray, I decided to wear peach eyes. And then um, I've this is what I do now. I have the bye bye under eye in light and medium, and I mix them together on my fingers because the light was too light, but the medium's too orange. This makes it just right. And then I'm using my benefit. Um, 24 hour brow setter. This isn't as good as the Anastasia, but 
it's decent but you can't mess with it during the day after it's dry because it starts to flake if you touch it and it looks ridiculous so but they didn't have the Anastasia when I was there so I just got that I have my old Urban Decay eye primer on under everything I'm wearing my underground eyeliner from Urban Decay and I have hit pan as of today on this bad boy. This is the True Match Blush in Baby Blossom. And I just hit pan. There. It's more peach than this. This looks more pink. It's really more peach. And then on top of that, I have discovered my Lorac Exposed Blush again, and I really like it. So, and it, you just need a super light hand with this because this is potent. It is. And I wore both of these mascaras today. I use the Rocket on the lower lashes in Waterproof, and this Maybelline Total Temptation in Waterproof on the top. And last but not least, my LA Colors Lipstick from the Dollar Tree. I just love this. It's in the color Sorbet. It's amazing. And it's a dollar. And it doesn't dry up your lips. You have to reapply it every so often, but it's awesome. Okay. Oh. And of course, my It Cosmetics Confidence in a Compact in light. Love this stuff. Every time I go anywhere and I wear this, everybody always tells me, oh my gosh, your skin looks so good. It's this. All right. That is the face of the day. It's five o'clock. Do you want dinner, huh? Is it time for dinner? Lola's know she knows it's time for dinner. Come on. I still need to put my Thanksgiving garland away. I'm slacking. Here's my amazing chicken cordon bleu from Harman's. I just love this. I adore this. It is the best stuff ever. And then I just put it on a pan with a little piece of foil on it. And then I put the foil, I turn the corners over like this because sometimes the cheese will melt out and then it might run off. And so I just make it like a little dish so that it won't run off. So it's the oven's at 350 and then I will pop these in for almost an hour, maybe about 50 minutes. I like to make sure my chicken's done, you know what I mean? Sure, this one's nice and big. And then this one's little. I guess this one's mine. <laughs> That's so not fair. Oh well, all I need is a little one. Yum yum. I also wanted to show you, this is from the Dollar Tree, and I did have it in the dishwasher, 
and it finally cracked all the way. I mean, it's you can see the edges there. Um, yeah, I guess if you put these in the dishwasher, they'll eventually crack. But I still have a whole bunch more that haven't cracked. This started as a hairline fracture for a few times, and then just now, just this last wash, it cracked. So anyway, just thought I'd let you know that. But my other ones down in here, they still look good. They haven't cracked at all. So they're worth a dollar. It's okay. It's all right, it's okay, we don't care anyway, huh? Huh, 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 huh. The ray of sunshine is just shining right down onto my chicken boob. I probably won't get it again, but it's good. My boob was half the size of yours. Oh, it wasn't almost half. I'm not. I don't need all this here. No, I'll just. I'll just eat it when you're done. See what you want, and then because I'm still eating mine, I'm just like, hey, lunch late. But you always eat lunch late. Oh, no, I can't. <laughs> there you go. Have some sauce on it. I can't eat all of that. Uh, that one could have been worse. <laughs> Maybe this will be leftovers for tomorrow lunch. Where'd you go for lunch? Mm. I'm just waiting for Momo or Lola to get here any minute now. Start begging. Momo, go! This is mustard mayonnaise sauce. Oh! Oh! Yeah. Is she begging over at your house or at your place? <laughs> My house? <laughs> Stay there, Lola. Don't come here.
gonna sniff my M&Ms, huh? She was until I put the spotlight on her. I can't leave anything out like that because she'll sit and play with it. Put my hair up. And this time I'm going to remember my chili towel. The other day when I was having a blood sugar drop, I forgot my chili towel. Well, I guess it didn't matter because it was raining on me anyway. I love these clips you guys from Target they're the best and I just stick them on there like that and it holds it I think, should I do it this way <laughs> or should I do it I'm trying to see which way does it hold better Definitely better from the top. Okay. Alright, cause like when I'm I just don't want it bouncing. I got enough bouncing on me when I'm doing my thing. Oh, there it is. And then you just take your chili towel, see, and you pull it out. And it's already wet, but I'm gonna re-wet it. Doesn't stink, it just smells good. Doesn't have any odor at all. And it matches my shirt. Okay. Check you later. It's closet time, everybody. And make it quick, because Mama's tired. <sighs> well, forget it. Forget the kids. They're not coming. Welcome to my closet, everybody. I just got home. I'm still sweating. Not as bad as I was the other night. I had lots of energy tonight. Better stamina. I just don't know if I'll ever be able to jog the full two miles. I just don't think I'll ever be able to. I just don't think I'll ever be able to. Oh well. It's okay. It's the, it's the downhill that's easy, but going uphill, that sucks. Like, the first, the first little bit is just flat, and then downhill, and then flat. And then from there, it's uphill all the way, baby. Anyway, I'm going to make this short because I am sweating like a pig, and I'm going to get in the shower. All right. Well, tomorrow is the 24th of July here in Utah, and that means... It's officially called Pioneer Day, and the state of Utah has it off most places. Well, like banks and the post office, they have it off, but like stores and restaurants, they still work. I still have to work. Daryl still has to work. But um, 
we have in downtown Salt Lake, there's this huge Pioneer Day parade and everybody, you know, we got high schools, marching bands, everybody, all the stakes, like all of our churches, all the Mormon church, you know, there's a state, wherever you live, you're in a stake and um, every stake who wants to participate makes a float. Um, and the theme has to do with the pioneers settling here in Utah or whatever. It just, and then different companies, um, businesses will make floats too. But anyway, it's just super fun. I think the parade lasts two hours. I think it's a two hour parade. And a lot of people will like sleep downtown in tents and just line the streets because it's like this big fat deal. I myself have never seen the parade in real life. I watch it on TV and I think it starts at 9 till 11. But it's really fun to watch. I'm sure it's really fun to see in real life, but I just can't imagine sitting out there in the sun in 90 plus degree heat. I just can't fathom that. But anyway, so tomorrow is just going to be like a fun day. Fun day, a regular day, but a little bit of fun on the side. Anyway, it'll, it'll be alright. I don't know what I'm doing tomorrow. Probably nothing, but... <laughs> We'll see. All right. I just love you. I got to get my clothes together for the big brothers, big sisters, and take showers. So I hope you have a wonderful sleepy, and we'll see you next time. Good night, everybody. You want to lick my cheesy Cheeto finger?